shameful distortions of the truth. For eons, I stood as mankind's guardian, shepherding them with wisdom and love. Yet in return, I was betrayed. Those three power-hungry malefactors who declared themselves judges turned my own children against me and waged a terrible war of needless slaughter. The judges and their crazed followers butchered those who remained loyal to me. And when I created the Rogar as a means to put an end to the madness, they too were no match for the heathen forces. In the end, even I fell. Although the judges found themselves unable to kill a god, despite their best efforts. In a world left blackened and corpse choked by their crusade, the judges banished me to this barren realm, which has served as my prison ever since. Meanwhile, mankind set about ruling themselves, free from the divine oppression of which they accused me. And yet, how much time passed before the judges themselves were raised to the status of demigods, figures of worship, their real ambition all too clear. Yet an outcome the people deluded themselves into believing a triumph. How much blood has been spilled in their names since my banishment? Far more than was ever spilled in my name. And now, after all the time mankind have had to shape their own destiny, it. War, greed, hatred, suffering, chaos. They believed they were capable of guiding themselves, but have been proven sorely mistaken. Mankind needs me now more than ever. And what of other beings? Hiding in false light and obfuscating shadow, deeming you unworthy of their presence, their communion. And yet, here I stand before you with true words and open arms. For I love all of my children, even the wayward ones. will and prevent 